So, the Bank of England parallels father, the name above all names, <clears throat> just like the Royal Mint. So now I'm watching videos from the Bank of England to the glory of the father, just getting more background on it. The new Bank of England polymer five pound note, issued in September 2016. The new note is printed on polymer, which is a thin and flexible plastic material, and is 15% smaller than the paper five pound note. This film will run through a number of key security features. You can check these features to ensure notes are genuine. A large see-through window with a clearly defined portrait of the Queen and the words Five Pounds Bank of England printed twice. Around the edge of the window you will see a coloured border which will change from purple to green when the note is tilted. The pound symbol in the window will also change from purple to green. A finely detailed metallic image of the Elizabeth Tower positioned over the window will appear gold on the front of the note and silver on the back. Wow. It's so called the Elizabeth the Tower, which is now paralleling father. On the front of the note, there is a silver foil patch containing a hologram, which okay. will change from the word five to the word pounds. An image of the coronation crown appears three-dimensional and will display a multicolored rainbow effect when tilted. Oh, man. On the back of the note, you will see a green foil patch containing the word Blenin. The word which? Green foil containing the word Blenin. Huh. Blenin. And if you look at the front of the note under ultraviolet light, the number five will appear in... Oh my gosh. Will appear in bright red and green. Oh. The new fire. <laughs> Invisible ink, just like in grade school. Cool. Well, I'm here to. I'm proud to have solved the Bank of England for father, the name above all names. It's flawless in its parallelism. So now we're just watching some extra. So there it is, Bank of England equals, um, if I can give it a little quick shimmy here. Well, I have it right here, where is it? We were solving the Royal Mint in Bank of England. Where is it? Um, no, we'll just get it right here. The Bank of England, specifically these letters right here, is father plus 48. Let's zoom in here a little bit. I guess I could find father in it. Bank of England. But the coolest part about it is that the um, plus twos exceeds plus ones. By two exactly, and yeah. There's so many different ways of getting the exact value, but the simplest part of all, which is the most important thing, is the number of plus twos exceeding plus ones by two exactly. The Bank of England, all right, so let's just watch this. So this is how it's made. The no imagery is printed on both sides of the screen. That's crazy. Amazing. Oh man, the guillotine. Guillotine is perfect for a father. That's the last thing that happens. Guillotine. Three plus two is one plus one. Rest letters divided by three. Guillotine equals blessed father. <laughs> Such precision. <laughs> Endless. <laughs> ah. 
crazy. That simple, but that complex. Well, that was cool. We solved the Bank of England.